Hey everybody, welcome back. Day two. Woo! Day two of the 15 days, 15 authors, 15 giveaways in 2015. That just kind of worked out all on its own. I just realized that's pretty funny. But today, the blogger that will be spotlighting the author for today um, is Holly from Holly's Red Hot Reviews. And she is my friend and she's amazing. And if you haven't checked out her blog, I will give you all of that stuff in the doobly-doo so you can check it all out. But today's author that we are spotlighting is Nicole Chase. Now, I discovered Nicole Chase kind of on accident. Um, a few years ago, I had kind of been over the whole, you know, vampire, paranormal stuff. Like, not paranormal, but just vampires. And I saw this book, and I just... I don't know, like, I I don't know what it was that drew me in, but I read it and I don't regret it at all. I absolutely love that series. It is Dark Betrayal Trilogy. The first book in that series is called Mortal Obligation. But I just really enjoyed that series and I thought she was a really solid, solid writer. And there was just so many, like, twists and turns and it just, like... It was exciting and I just absolutely devoured those books and so I was really glad that I did discover her. I know she has a new series and I think it just released not too long ago, but it's The Accidental Assassin. Now this book sounds really, really good and I, I'm really upset that I haven't been able to read this yet. So that is another book that she does have out. She has quite a few different series out already, uh, some paranormal, some romance, um, N-A-Y-A. -A. So she's kind of like everywhere, which I really, really enjoy that she's so diverse. And that was the reason that I asked her to be a part of this because I really enjoy authors that can kind of go from different types of genres. And she's, I'm telling you, she's just awesome. So without further ado, uh, I'm going to go ahead and switch it over to her. I did ask her a bunch of questions. Um, so that you as the readers can kind of get to know who she is as an author. So before I forget, in this 15 days, uh, this spotlight tour, it's not only spotlighting the author, but also blogs and bloggers. So today, the spotlight on the blogger is going to be Holly from Red, Holly's Red Hot Reviews. And I'm going to link below um, where you can click on it so you can get to the giveaway, you can get to see... Um, her blog spotlight as well as well as you know any information she wants you guys to know about and also with her with the bloggers as well as the authors I did kind of ask them questions so that you guys as the readers can kind of get to know them better so that's all linked down there in the description so go ahead and make sure that you click on that so that you get to know Holly as well as Nicole Chase so without further ado here you go on the Nicole Hi, I'm Nicole Chase, author of the Royal series, Suddenly Royal, Recklessly Royal, Reluctantly Royal, and the Assassin series. Accidental Assassin is out now. I also have Flukes, a new adult paranormal romance, and a YA trilogy, um, the Dark Betrayal trilogy. I was asked to help celebrate the book boyfriend reviews blog anniversary. So congratulations, you guys. It's tough work running a blog, and I appreciate everything that you guys have put into it. So thank you. Um, all right. They have a few questions for me, um, and I'm going to go through them and try to not sound stupid. So let's see. Okay. Other than writing, do you have any other hobbies? Well, I would love to have hobbies, but being a full-time author and a full-time mom doesn't leave a lot of free time. Uh, I do love to travel, and I love to craft and <laughs> paint, and um, I'm thinking about taking up cross-stitching, So, which is really kind of random, I guess. <laughs> but I think it would be a nice way to relax in the evenings. <laughs> okay, next question is, is it hard to write about YA paranormal, then switch it up to contemporary new adult romance? What is your secret? No secret, guys. I just write the books I want to write. Um, I think that the question actually boils down to 
what makes paranormal and contemporary so different, and it's the world building. Um, and I guess I kind of cheated at that because in the Royal series, there's a lot of world building in there anyways that I, I had to put together and, and make work in a realistic manner. And the same thing for the Assassin series. Uh, you know, obviously I had to build that world. I don't actually live in it, so I don't <laughs> I had to figure it out. But um, yeah, so no, no big secret, just uh, working to write the story that I want to get out. Okay, uh, next question. Name one food you cannot live without while you are writing. I love frozen grapes. One of my favorite snacks ever. If you've never had them, you have to try it. Perfect in the summertime. Um, and they're even great, like, if you freeze them and then put them in a glass of water. You know, it, anyways, I love frozen grapes. I like frozen things. Um... Yeah, so, oh, and Coca-Cola. I know that's more than one thing, but I'm addicted to Coca-Cola, and I have to have it. I have to. And don't give me any of that diet crap, because that's just disgusting. All right, uh, next one. If I could tell my readers anything, what would it be? And this is the honest God truth. Just thank you. Thank you. You guys have made my career for me. If you hadn't taken a chance on my books, hadn't picked up one, read it, and then told a friend, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing now. I wouldn't be writing books and living a dream that I never thought possible, uh, sharing the, the crazy stories in my head. So thank you. Thank you very, very much. You'll never know how much I appreciate it. Okay, and that's it, you guys. So thank you again for letting me help you celebrate your blog anniversary book boyfriend reviews. I wish you many, many more. Uh, see you soon. Bye.